like that, you got the smallest car humanly possible. This is the smallest car humanly possible. The only thing that would have been more awkward than this is if we had like a motor scooter uh, or sitting on the back of it. Oh, that's a good idea. You no, it's a that. terrible idea. Is it? Because well, I'd be like holding on to you and I'd have to like hold the guitar like in front of you. Well, it'd be just super like dumb oh, and dumber. Genius. Dumb and dumber. There's dumb and dumber two coming up. Did you know that? No. The new one? They just started production last week. It took so long. I know, it's beautiful. Okay, you ready? I'm ready. All right. I think. I'm as ready as I can be. Ugh. All right. Are you gonna <laughs> turn that over here now? <laughs> no, I can't. Said, oh sure you can. You can put it here. <laughs> I'll, okay, so I'll drive here. Do you want me to just, I'll play? You almost should. This yeah, is I, a, can, I can. You can chord it? No, that'd be terrible. All right. All right, well, so let's go. If you hit the headstock, I apologize. I can't see anything. If we die. Oops, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we're fine as well. I feel like that's turn. not the first time or the last time. Well, that's that going to happen. Time, All right. Yeah. All right, well, okay, well, let's, uh, let's, let's do this. I'm Zach. Andrew Allen hey, is hey. Uh, joining us today, who has uh, come all the way up from Los Angeles yeah. to, play, uh, to play a song for us. Mm -hmm. uh, Lone Star has given us a smart car. I love it. There's a reason why. I'm ready. Uh, I, if you don't know Andrew Allen or his music, I will tell you that he is a hippie. <laughs> He's from British Columbia. He's barefoot currently. Yes, that's right. <laughs> and um, he wears a lot of hemp. And I smell like patchouli. Yeah, patchouli. <laughs> it's a good thing it's a convertible smart car. Yeah. Um, and uh, so we thought that this would be a great chance for uh, to play um, play music in the car. What's going on? I don't know. It's beeping at me. Our doors not closed. I don't. Maybe not closed. Door, there's only two doors. <laughs> yeah. This is safe. I think we got it. It's very good. Yeah. All okay. right. So yeah. anyway, uh, he's a hippie, so we're in a little car. That's really. The, <laughs> I, don't know what's, I don't know what that clicking noise is. Is my door open? God, I love this car. This is fun. Parallel park. Oops, what that? Parallel parking at downtown was awesome. I don't think you even have to parallel park it. You just drive straight in. You're like the same That's width right. as you are long. <laughs> Put it in the back of the truck. Yeah. All right. So uh, you have moved down to LA. Yeah, I moved there seven months ago to um, sort of get a little more dialed in with the whole songwriting community, which I have, which mm -hmm. has been amazing. So um, who's who's turned you down so far? Turned me down from actual songwriting sessions. So far, not really anybody. Um, Rain Maida and I were chatting, but he, he hasn't got back to me. Mm -hmm. I think he's busy. He's busy? Um, but I, I did have a couple songs that I pitched. Um, one of them, Maroon 5, was super interested in. They held on to it for like a month, and then they let go of it. I was like, hey, no, take it. Take it. And then uh, Jesse McCartney liked it, so him and I worked on it a bit together. And then he was like, I kind of like your version better. And I was like, that's an honor. I appreciate that, but I still want you to take it. <laughs> still buy my song. Exactly. So, um, you know, it's just one of those things. You just keep just keep climbing. Just keep working. Fun. Yeah. Good. Yeah. Okay, so um, some of your favorite songs that would be on the radio right now. Here, can you... Oh, some of my favorite songs that are on the radio right now. Um, I actually really like the song Roar by Katy Perry. Mm -hmm. I think it's cool. Can you, can you play it? Really? Uh, yeah, yeah, maybe. Let's see here. Well, you have a YouTube video of you playing the guitar, or I ukulele. Do. Yeah. All right. I'll just do a bit. Sure, yeah. I used to buy my tongue and hold my breath. Scared to rock the boat and make a mess. So I sat quietly. Agree politely, you held me down. I got up, hey! already brushing off the dust. You hear my voice, you hear that sound like thunder gonna shake the ground. You held me down, I got up, hey! I'm with something about the dust. <laughs> <laughs> See it all, I've got the eye of the tiger, a fighter. Dancing through the fire Cause I am a champion And you're gonna hear me roar louder It is hot in this car. <laughs> it's hot. Jeez, oh, let's man. open a window. As I'm roaring, I'm like, I'm starting to sweat. All right, so, okay, uh, favorite song of all time. Favorite song of all time. Um, you know what? If I could have written one song, mm -hmm. it would have been Say It Ain't So by Weezer. All right. I think that song is so rad. Um, one of my other favorite songs... It's the first CD I ever purchased, which is maybe not awesome, but I think it was kind of cool. It was the Cool Running soundtrack, and it was, oh, really? uh, I can see Calgary. clearly now. Oh, really? Yeah. No way. The reggae version. That was, um, that was shot here. Really? You are. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah it was, wasn't it? Right that's up right. at the uh, the Olympic Park. Yeah, that's right. Um, okay. I love the Olympic Park. Okay, so your new single is called? It's called Play With Fire. Okay. And uh, I had an ex-girlfriend once, and she sucked. Apparently, yep. based on the song, she was not nice, was she? Well, this is the thing. I'm passive aggressive, sort of by nature. Mm -hmm. Is my seat warmer on? I think you're touching it with your oh, hand. Yeah. I'm like, my <laughs> butt is on fire right now. Like, Sorry. why am I warming up? Oh. I'm not nervous. I'm just all of a sudden really hot. That's really funny. So, um, 
Anyway, so this girl, she ended up hanging out with my best friend like very closely. Yeah. Like the wrong kind of hanging out. Yeah. And Good friend. Uh, yeah, I know. Yeah. yeah, exactly. But it's weird because like I, I didn't blame him really. I blamed her. But anyway, so she uh, she came to me one day and she was all like, "Hey, you know, like I want to make this right. Like, are we cool?" Mm -hmm. And of course, in my passive aggressive nature, I was like, "Yes, we're fine. I'll get over it." What's the lyric say? We're Oh, we're magnificent. Magnificent. Yeah, yeah. And so then I went home and I was like, I'm gonna burn your house down. Nice. Which I never did. No. But, um, you know, because that would be a problem. Career and limiting. We'd be doing this in a jail cell. That's right. <laughs> yeah. oh, and uh, my content would be very different. That's no doubt. Okay, so can you play it for us? Yeah, I can. All right. I'll do my best. All right. You can Oops. move that over here. What? You there's, no, there's no room for the butt of it. Oh, really? <laughs> Not really. I'll do my best. All right. Good acoustics in here, though. She wrote a song called Bitch, didn't she? Yeah, she Sorry. did. Sure, I took that one from me. Yeah. Well, you kind of just did, actually. <laughs>